The fifth sage? Right, so we're looking for the fifth sage. But to be honest, I am not entirely certain where to look. <gasps> I've got an idea. I've got an idea. Playing games on a React channel? Unheard of. <gasps> <laughs> Where is the ninja village chat? Where is the ninja village? Where is it? I actually don't know to be honest Is it is it in like in here Hatano village? No, it's not that one Go ninja go ninja Ludfo's bog. Oh, I know what that is, I think. Lake Verona? No. Or wetland. Zara's Domain? No. Goon. I know what I'm looking for, I just don't remember how to get them. What is the ninja village? It's the one Impa is from. Hang on, maybe we can look at Impa's profile. Uh, former chief of the Sheikah who served the royal family of Hyrule for generations and is living witness to its near extinction. Sometime after guiding Link through the Kalamia, Impa made a granddaughter Paya, the new chief. Being over a century old hasn't stopped him from doing her part in the search for Princess Zelda. She's investigating the geoglyphs around Hyrule, certain they will provide clues to where the princess is. That doesn't help. Damn! Where's, where's your village? Hmm. Following the upheaval, I mobilized the Zonai survey team to investigate the runes to connect the Zonai. There must be a clue hiding out there. <gasps> the ruins from the Age of Legends. Oh, I think it's worth revisiting the ruins from the Age of Legends. Oh, okay. The Yiga clan. No, not them. The other ones. Right, so she's given us a clue. Uh, now, where the f is it in here? I think so. Yeah. I was wondering that as well, Sonic, if the last sage is underground. But I think Pyre is the last sage. Uh, that's that's my guess. Maybe. <laughs> Hang on. Oh, all right. She said to come revisit this place, right? So let's let's do I'm pretty sure she she meant this place. So let's 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 do that. It's gotta be it's gotta be tied to the Shiko. Got to be. You making progress in your investigation of the geoglyphs? Oh So the dragon's tears were shed by Princess Zelda when she transformed <gasps> And the geoglyphs were drawn by an ancient people who touched those memories and saw visions as you did? Perhaps in the past they were more attuned to that sort of thing than the people of today. Hmm, I understand now. So that is the truth of it all. Link, 
If all the memories you saw are true, then that means since our Princess Zelda has become the Light Dragon, she can never again return to her original form. Oh. It is painfully tragic. Our dear Princess Zelda. Oh. No, it cannot be. Oh. There must be a way. Some method to restore Princess Zelda to her former self. I will return to Kakariko Village and review the situation. That is the most I can do to help Princess Zelda. Sorry, I have a, a tumble over my words. Kakariko Village. Where you at? Chat, keep your eyes out. We're looking for Kakariko Village. I actually haven't been there yet, so... <laughs> All the time I've put into this game, and I, I just haven't bothered to, to visit. I, uh... Can you say that? Thanks on that. Kakariko Village. Kakariko Village. Kakariko Village. <laughs> it's not as easy as it looks. <laughs> I think I just, like, I read fast, and... I'm, I might, might, might just have, like, a, the tiniest of stutter. Um, so... Holy shit! You're a madman. But, but... But I can't... It won't change my coordinates. I can just, like, guesstimate it. I'm here, so I want to be down this way, up, and then over this way. That's the Zorda mid. Also, there's a great fairy around here. I need to f talk to the great fairy to boost my defense. But I, I, I can't, I haven't been able to get them to come out of their shell yet. Oh, it's a skull. I remember that place. That's where you got the Dark Link outfit in the first game. Map of the past are usually similar, so it should be east of Hyrule. Yes, that's, that's a, I'm, I'm a, I'm, I'm on the eastern side. Zora Domain. Is this it? No, that's not it. That's the, that, that other town. That's the other, other town. I know that is. <laughs> under the lake? <laughs> what? <laughs> what do you mean under the lake? Under Lake Akalaka? What? Underneath the lake? The Sheik, like, Kakariko village is underneath the lake. What? Tingle Island. Oh, no. Oh, relative to the map. Like sumac on these notes. <laughs> Too easy. Too easy. Ateno Village. <laughs> I I don't know where this this village could be. You say it's underneath Lake Akalaka, like down here. I'm trying to like keep an eye out for like a series of buildings, you know. No, oh, it's not that. I remember it being a small village. 
This this isn't the the place. This is um this is a Tano, this one. From the castle, go a little to the right and down. What this? Close, close to this. Okay. Lake of the Horse God. This does look familiar. Hang on, hang on. If it, if it's around this part, right? First of all, let let's get some height, shall we? Let's 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 elevate ourselves. Maybe we'll we'll get like you know we'll we'll see it from above, maybe. <laughs> Keep your eyes peeled, chat. Beneath me. No. No, it is, isn't it? Maybe. <laughs> it's hard to tell. <laughs> nah, this isn't it. This is like in the jungle. With the Lazalfos and that. Oh, hello. Goodbye. I would ask that you go to the land and bring tidings to me of the mother goddess statue. Oh. Sadly, I'm not going to be doing much side quests. Truth be told, I kind of want to, but uh, but I, I just don't have time. Is this it? What were those coordinates again? 1800, zero 09. Let me just copy and paste those. I would do all the side quests in the map before doing any of the main quest lines. So, north. It's very north of here. It's like. <laughs> very, very north. That's not it. Goron City. Try near the Lantern Lake. Uh, uh, now I've got to find the Lantern Lake. Uh. 
Name up a Oh no, it's getting worse. <laughs> now I've got to find Mount Fiora and the Lantern Lake. Lantern Lake. That's it. It's right there. Oh my god, villain, thank you. Oh my god. Right there. Yes, villain. <laughs> I imagine how long it would take us a dick around <laughs> to find that. <laughs> like this one spot on the goddamn map. <laughs> Fucking hell. <laughs> <laughs> Which way is it now? It's right here. This is it, right? Yeah, this way. Did you say very lost? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Bruh. In my defense, right, the game has basically said, go find the fifth sage. And that's about it. <laughs> nobody knows who they are. Nobody knows where they are. Good luck. <laughs> As you're leaving, Pura's like, a good riddance. <laughs> yeah, go muck about for a bit. <laughs> Come back in an hour, Link. And I'll have the next part of the story ready. <sighs> he just runs off with a stick in his hand. <laughs> Come on, guys! He's like talking to all the party members. Let's go save the kingdom. Nobody else sees them. And they just think he's fucking crackers. <laughs> they give you the intel equivalent of, here's a rock, go play. Yeah. <laughs> You're overshooting it, did I? One sec, let me climb to the top of this rock. Which I'm, I'm clearly not going to get to the top of now. Oh, you're right. Yeah, holy shit. It's like hidden in the woods. Fucking Chica, man. Hard as fuck to find. Never around when you need them. Pyre, where you at? I've come to tell you you're a chosen one. Hidden in the woods like some kind of ninja. Is it hidden leaf village? Oh god. Making me physically sick on a fireplace. Pyre! I've come to see your birthmark. Wait, does she have like a saucy bucket of a under a bed? Pura's diary. <laughs> Perhaps it's a side effect of returning to my previous form. Wait, this is Pura's diary? From a hundred years ago, but I had a dream about that time. Back then, Robbie and I did whatever we pleased at the Royal Ancient Lab. Age reversal experimentation, explosions, warping, failing explosions, explosion prevention, device explosion. I don't care about this. I've been lookout landing a lot. I don't care. I want to see, I want to read Pyre's dirty notes. The last page. We must learn more about the ring ruins. It's my responsibility as chief. Oh, what? She's got not- she doesn't have anything in her diary about me. That's some bullshit, man. Oh, 
Kaya, where are you? Oh my god, it's just levitating. There's Lady Pi. Wait, where? Who? Oh! That's disappointing. She keeps a second secret diary. Just what? Where? Where's Irag? Where? <laughs> I can't tell if you're joking or not, Sirak. <laughs> Where is it? Oh, you were just kidding? Oh, fuck all, I'm disappointed. <laughs> yeah. No, I'll shut up, Tauro, you handsome son of a gun the ring ruins are the most intriguing ruins i've researched especially this one the way part it floats up there you had the foresight to focus on all our all of these special ruins and invite the survey team to take a look right away uh. i'm impressed chief pyre oh no I, I i'm no chief i just couldn't refuse my predecessor when she decided to pass the title to me rather suddenly i'm really a chief in name only since i still have a great deal to hmm? Oh, is that you, Master Link? Yeah, fucking damn right. <laughs> I'm so happy that I get to see you again. Aya, Chief of Kakariko Village. What took you so long, Link? Mm. I'm overjoyed that both you and the Princess Zelda are safe, Master Link. Eh? The Zelda who appeared in the upheaval is an imposter born of the Demon King, and the real Princess Zelda is still missing. Ah. Are you serious, Master Link? It's certainly hard to believe. Yet I find it possible that you would make up such a thing. Mm. Come to think of it, the Princess Zelda came to Kakariko Village. Mm. She ordered us to not let anyone go near the floating Rin Ruin, no matter what. Oh. She left as soon as she arrived. I wasn't able to ask her anything more about those unusual instructions. We thought it was to protect the villagers from harm. This ruin does look like it could crash down at any moment. That's what Pyra and I suspect at least. Oh. Oh my apologies, Master Link. I was so pleased to see you. I completely forgot common courtesy. Please allow me to introduce Mr. Tauro, an esteemed member of the Zonai survey team. Ah. I invited him here to investigate the ring ruins that fell on our village. Ah. He's incredibly deep knowledge on the Zonai civilization. He's even familiar with Zonai script. He's truly an incredible talent individual. talented individual. He's also built like a fucking truck. Jesus. Oh. It's clear that the floating rune ruin that we were forbidden to explore is a unique and incredibly invaluable find. Several more ring ruins with such a shape have fallen down around the village. Most have broken apart in some way. What's fascinating is that a stone slab with writing was found at each site. Deciphering the text showed that each slab contains rather interesting content, including the mention of sages. There's still so much we don't understand. Aww. I think that perhaps the ruin floating in the air also has a slab that makes mention of the sages. Until now, I'd given up on investigating the ruin, believing Princess Zelda's orders were for the best. But if that princess was an imposter, that changes everything. Oh. Princess Zelda's imposter, the Demon King's underling, forbade anyone from investigating the floating ruin. You already told us this! That must mean that doing so would pose a threat to the Demon King. Uh. If that is the case, we must survey the floating ruin as soon as possible. Uh. Right you are, Mr. Tauro. There is no longer any reason to prohibit your research. Let's open up the floating ruin ruin at once. Knowledge is tugging on the line. Somebody's fucking tugging. Time to reel in some results. <laughs> Your Lurulin phrasing is coming through, Mr. Taro. You must really be pleased. Mm. It's just, there's one problem. We still need to determine how to conduct the survey. Oh. It's clear that the interior of this ring ruin is hollow. Sadly, there doesn't seem to be an entrance. If the contents of the other ring ruins are in any indication, there should be a stone slab inside engraved with Zonai script. Oh no. First we should look for a way to confirm that there's stone slab inside. However, we also don't want to damage these precious ruins. Pardon me, I was lost in thought. I'd better hurry and tell everyone about this so we can open up the ruins. It's under the house. By the way, good luck buying the Sheikah armor. You need to start cooking. What? What do you mean cooking? 
I'm not overly fussed about the Sheikah armor, to be honest, because it's going to be stealth based. And you know that's not my thing. Oh, look! <laughs> Radiant mask. The paint on this shirt is made from crushed luminous stones. It causes the shirt to show a glue glowing bone-like pattern in the dark. Why? Oh my god, it's like 5k a piece. Uh, I mean, the defense is even lower on it. It's like half my defense and I don't do stealth. Yeah, I'm going to skip on them. <laughs> no thanks. Hiya, where are you at? I neglected to tell you this earlier, Master Link. I've taken over the title of Chief of my grandmother. Naturally, I still have a long way to go before I truly earn the title, but I intend to follow up the path from first to last step. Finding out that Princess Zelda I met was a pawn of the Demon King, how to put this to words. Let's just say it throws me off my balance. So hard to believe. And yet, I do believe you, Master Link. I could not bring myself to doubt you for even a moment. And if these ruins pose some kind of a threat to the Demon King, then we must accelerate our research at all costs. However, looking inside the ruins without damaging them is a difficult hurdle. Oh, I'm sorry. Let's just keep going. Let's go. I need I need to ascend. And quickly. Let's eke out as much progress as we can in the next like 40 minutes. <laughs> but stealth damages two time piece. It's not my style, mate. Not my style. I'd, I'd rather throw my weapon at the enemy in the face, like right between the eyes. Oh, man alive. Is this what I'm supposed to be doing? Tomorrow doesn't feel like it. Stealth is good for situations, I agree. But it's just not what I do. Well, I found it. Now what? Am I imagining things? It looks like you just slipped into the ruins. No, forget I said anything. It must have been a trick of the light. Silly thought, but I wish I could get a pitch. Oh, gonna make me go back up there. Can't you just believe me? Pia believes me. He's too handsome for his own good. Oops, I pressed, I pressed the wrong button. Oh, I agree. Should believe anything he says. 100%. Are you satisfied? <laughs> what about this image? Takes it takes out like the the weird like a dick pic he took inside the ruins. <laughs> What's this you've got? Oh shit! Uh, wrong one. Uh, could it could it really be? <gasps> Hiya, Kali. Look at this. <laughs> could this be? 
It's super fucking low resolution as well. The interior of the floating ring ruin. Wow, the stone slab is so clearly- No, it's not. There appear to be Azona inscriptions on this one as well, just like the other ring ruins. Toro, if you would. Let me see what I can decipher. Hmm. Promise Zelda, summonly signed Mineru. Sage of Hide the Key. Southeast! It trusts future. Wish defeat Demon King. That's all I can make out. There's some lettering I can't figure out before Southeast. But Mineru seems like someone's name. No. Look at the context of Mineru. I do believe this is the first time one of these slabs has put a name to the Sage. This also mentions Zelda and the Demon King. How fascinating. <laughs> The inscriptions are telling us all sorts of essential information. What's the matter? Nothing, it's just that part before southeast section. I think it says Dragonland. Hmm. Oh. You're right! Pyre knows the stuff. This should be read as Dragonland Southeast. Fantastic work, Pyre. Oh. Thank goodness I've proven useful. It seems my continued Zonai language studies have paid off. Oh no, I'm being upstaged. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna try and murder Pyre. Where were we? Something about a dragon land to the southeast. Hmm, how familiar are you with the southeast Hyrule? There's a site in Faron that has long been known as the Zion Zonai Ruins. It predates the ruins falling from the sky and is home to many ancient relics. If memory serves, there were dragon designs on those ruins that I haven't seen anywhere else. <laughs> Kaleep, great catch! The Zonai ruins in Farron. There's a good chance that's exactly what this opponent mm. is at. There's a Kaleep. Fantastic work. W what did you just say? Th this inscription is pointing us towards Farron's Zonai ruins. Aww. No, not that. The next bit. A certain adjective was used. I believe it started with fan and ended with a tastic. What was it again? Mm. Oh, this poor guy's never had any <laughs> approval his entire life. Yes. Kaleep, what fantastic. He's like... Oh. Silently tear, tearing up. Me. Meanwhile, the rest are like, oh, come on. When we put together the script on the stone lab and translate it, we get definitive mentions of the sage Mineru and the demon king, and someone with the same name as Princess Zelda. Something related to all three of them must be waiting at Zonai Ruins in southeast oh. of Hyrule. We've landed a real catch here. Thank you all for your help, truly. Now we've no time to dawdle. There's research to be done. <laughs> Kalip, will you join me? Oh, of course I would. <laughs> Fantastic addition to the team. Very good. With that settled, let's be off to the Zonai Ruins of Faron. First, we head southwest. We'll establish a base in the Poplar Foothills at the Skyview Tower by the ruins. In search of new discoveries, we make for Faron. I left just like that. Well, I'm sure this two will be fine. I must study more about Zonai civilization so I don't fall behind Taro and Kalip. Yet it seems somewhat frivolous next to the mysteries of the real Princess Zelda's whereabouts. I don't doubt that she is safe and well, I must believe that. As chief of this village, I can't leave my people so I must place the search in your capable hands. I pray that Princess Zelda will return to us soon. Goodbye, Pyre! Sorry, chat. We have to leave Pyre now. Was it here? Yeah. And we'll never see her again. Probably. <coughs> Excuse me. Ooh. Take her with you. In my backpack. <laughs> like Yoda. <laughs> Sticks her head out. Link is hot. <laughs> I, I can't do... I can't do a... Yoda voice. Yo. Yes. I should welcome you to a humble base of operations. Behold, this is where the real investigation starts. It might not seem like much next to that Skyview Tower, I'll concede. Oh. Going forward, our research will proceed from here. Taro has already gone off to the Zonai Ruins. If memory serves, he spoke off starting his investigation around Dracuzo Lake. Go southeast and you should find the Zonai Ruins as a volunteer to inspect. I'm curious if the Dragonland written in the Ring Rune will have any more leads than the Deem King or Princess Zelda. 
Ordinarily, I'd be right there by his side in the field, of course. But I'm worn out from center to the base. I'll need some time to recuperate before I begin my own survey. <sighs> All right. Well, we need to go down here, right? <clears throat> I, I assume. Oh, is Link. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Oh, this has got to be it. There's like a campfire there. Khalid, the influence of the upheaval has spread to the Zona Ruins. Did you see the pillar-shaped ruin in front of this tent? There shouldn't be any artifacts of that kind around here, normally. There's more. The rubble at the base of the pillar opened, revealing a way inside, a new discovery. Naturally, I'll be going inside to investigate shortly. Join me as soon as you can. There's a way inside now? Assumably, it means, like, over this way. This doesn't seem right. Must remember we can't climb in uh, in rain very well. I am not entirely certain what he's referring to. It's this doll right here, okay. Is this guy the next sage? <laughs> this dude? Is he the next sage? <laughs> You came after all. I figured you would after made after you made that breakthrough in the ring ruins. But listen to this. I've already got a whopper of a discovery on my hook here. Hey, look at this. <laughs> it's a Zonai mu mural, complete with intact text and style is unmistakable. It's nothing short of miraculous that it's still here and basically intact. Which, come to think of it, might be a... Uh, what? A scribable? A scribable? To the Zonai's advanced technology. Got a fair bit of knowledge of the script, so I just had to try deci deciphering it. Some of it still eludes me. Mm. Maybe it's a poem or some kind of code. I'm gonna guess it's the latter because that was in red. I'll read it out loud so we can both get on the same oh. page. Wear the electric garb hidden at long necked dragons. At long necked dragons along the wide mouthed forest serpent. Forest serpent and dragons? Aww. It calls to mind the tall pillars found around these ruins, designed to look like dragons. Forest serpent though? I haven't seen any designs like that. What am I missing? What other wide mouthed forest serpent is there? Maybe the forest serpent bit does remind me of the sock. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> the song that compared to the Dracosi River is to a forest dragon. 
But anyway, there's more to this code. I'll keep reading. Aww. Offer a Zonai charge to the altar at the tail. I'm pretty sure I got that right, but I have no idea what it means. Mm -hmm. Zonai charge. And where's the tail with the altar? If we can crack all the riddles to this code, I'm sure that even great discoveries await us. Well, for starters, we need to wear this, right? I think it said that. Let's look the part as well. Let, let's go all in. Yeah, let's look the part. What does this shirt do though? I missed that. Produces electricity during thunderstorms. So that doesn't sound great. Right, so that's the head, right? So where's the tail? Like over here? I guess we follow the river. <laughs> oh gosh, sorry. <clears throat> Is that swimming in the water? This has got to be it. I really thought this would be, you know. Times like this, I wish I had like... <laughs> I could hit L1 and just bring Mega Man out and get a clue. <laughs> Oh, 
Do I have a do I have a clue? Can I get a clue? Where the electric garb hidden at long neck dragons along the wide mouthed forest serpent? What? Offer a Zonai charge to the altar at the tail? This has got to be the altar of the tail, surely. It's the tail of the river, right? And there's an altar. Where the electric garb hidden at long neck dragons along the wide mouths of forest serpent. I think I'm doing that. Where the electric garb, yes. The the electric guard garb hidden at long necked dragons along the wide mouthed forest serpent. To me, that sounds like all that's referring to is is this spot. And then the rest of it is referring to this. So I don't know. See any of the like entryways or rooms, and this is very clearly lit up, you know, to suggest that I go in here. the electric gap hidden at long neck dragons along the wide mouth forest serpent. Is there other shrines up the river? What are you doing outside? seen other shrines or doorways along the way. And that takes me to that door. So even if I go this way, it leads to the same place.
It said something about long neck snake, right? When it says the gap, does it mean like the entire outfit or, or is it this outfit? Charged headdress. Oh, it must mean like the whole gear. That's why it means like the whole get up. Well, in that case. Originally, I thought it meant just like the, uh, just the chest piece or something. Stairs. These pants look like the kind of shit somebody who's been abandoned on, like, stranded on an island for months would go. Like, those, those, that's what those pants look like. Right, now head over this way. Yeah, when it said garb, I thought it meant just the chest piece. Trying to avoid these fart, farts, these fights, because I just can't be asked. You really don't get much out of it, you know. That's that storm cloud. I wondered when we would investigate the storm cloud. Okay. See that? Lightning struck the dragon pillar too. Is someone in those ruins? Link walks out in his new outfit and Kalip's like, it's a god. It's you again. We think a terrible lightning strike hit here, but I'm glad to see you weren't hurt. I'm just soaking oh. wet. I've never seen lightning strike like that. And even stranger, the dragon statue's eyes seem to glow up just for it. You know anything about this? Fill us in on what happened. Oh. Unbelievable. A mechanism in the ancient ruins got rid of the thunderclouds and revealed some new sky islands? Mm. Great catch. Another amazing discovery on the books. In fact, <laughs> I'd say it's the whole of the century. Aww. It's a significant discovery, to be sure. I'd like to investigate further, but we have no way of getting up there. Oh. You're right. That doesn't make it any less exciting, though. We need to report this to Pura right oh. away. I'm going back to Kakariko Village. I want to write up the recent events around the floating ring ruin in a report for Pura. You should stick around here to conduct a thorough investigation. Find out if there are any more discoveries to be made. 
What? Remain here? You mean alone? Uh... Yes, even if we can't get up to the sky, there's so much to discover on land. It's our duty to unravel all of it. You can do this, Khalid. Uh... It wants me to investigate alone? Fieldwork isn't my strong suit. But this may be my chance to make a historic discovery. Uh... Right. Leave this to me, Taro. I'll begin preparing at once. I'll need to head back to our base of operations for a bit first. That dude is it. No, sir. <laughs> The map, yes. We removed the storm cloud. Let's get to those islands. Woo. What if somebody just accidentally steps on the damn thing? You know, besides Link. Am I not gonna be able to? Yeah, yeah, I'll have enough stamina to make this. At first I was assuming I'd have to, have to land on the bottom one, but no. Ooh, my outfit's all glowy. Oh, that's not good. Change, quick. <laughs> all my shields are electric. Ah! I've got these two. Wait, my bow! <laughs> right. Let's get you in some proper hero gear, okay, Link? Where, where am I? Trousers of Twilight. Damn. Okay, well, I'm guessing this is the next big dungeon then. But uh, we're not going to be able to tackle it tonight, I'm afraid. This is where we have to draw the line. <laughs> 